Hello everyone, good morning. Um, so I'm starting my YouTube channel and um, this is just what I do in my life. So just be a part of it, enjoy it. Um, today I'm going to be making Alethea breakfast. So what I chose for her breakfast today is oatmeal and bananas. She loves that stuff so much. So um, I'm just going to show you how I make it and hopefully you'll like it and uh, well, let's get started. All right, so here I have the oatmeal that I use. I already um, portioned out the half a cup of oats and it gets one cup of water and I like to use a banana for the banana oatmeal of course and my pot. I'm going to go ahead and turn on the dial there to about six. Pour in my water. Let that get to boiling and uh, we'll be back. Hello pretty girl. How's your morning? It's good? Yeah, that's awesome. I'm making your favorite. Yeah, I am. I know you can't wait. You love that banana oatmeal. You're so pretty. What? <laughs> You're a silly girl. I'm so cute. Do you like tomatoes? I love you. Good morning. Do you like pancakes? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. All right, so our water is starting to boil. And what I like to do is, I like to just smush up the banana before it gets in there. Just goes a little easier for me. I already unpeeled it because it was too hard to do holding the phone. And using both hands, it was impossible. So we just smush it up. It doesn't have to be completely mushed up because it's going to get mushed more when it cooks with the oatmeal. I guess that's good enough right there. Right. And we're just going to add our oatmeal. Give that a little stir. And then we're just going to put in our bananas. Our banana. Da, da, da. Come on. Hard to do with one hand. <laughs> I just get the little bits that are left with the spoon and give it a good little stir. All right, let that just cook a little bit. And put the bowl in the sink. All righty. Looking good so far. I need my spoon. Put that in the sink. All right, we got the spoon back. Whisks there. Alrighty, let it do its thing. Work its magic. So these are the oats I like to use. Yeah. It doesn't cost very much when you buy it. It's so much cheaper than buying the regular baby stuff in the baby section. You get so much more when you make it yourself. There's the serving directions. All right, so while that's boiling, um, I like to make a little bit more than what she would eat normally in one sitting. Um, because, you know, I don't like to cook every day. <laughs> uh, sometimes I just want to be able to pop it in the microwave or the warmer and just be able to feed her while I'm waking up, getting everybody ready. and So that works out really good. I got these little jars from Walmart. These little ball mason jars. They're freezer safe. So I haven't really gotten too big into the canning, so I don't really know how to do the whole canning it so I can put it in the cabinet. 
but it works well just putting it in the freezer and then the night before you know sticking it in the refrigerator let it thaw and then it's ready to to be warmed up and served we'll get to that a little later so this looks like it's going along pretty good Father-in-law is going to kill me for using the spoon on this pot. For you, Jimmy. There we go. No scraping my pots now. Alright, so I'm just going to go ahead and turn the heat off. Looks like it's all coming along nicely. Alright, so what I like to do next is set it aside. Let it cool down a little bit because then I'm going to put it in the blender. Alright, so it is done cooling down. I went ahead and put Alethea in her high chair because she's already hungry and ready to eat. So um, I got her sitting over there just waiting. Hello pretty girl. Are you ready to eat? You're ready to eat? You're gonna eat your tray? Don't eat the tray! Alright, I'm gonna finish up your breakfast and I'll be right back. <laughs> Alright, it looks cool down to me. Oh yeah. That's definitely nice and cool down. Oh, hard to do with the one hand. Alright, I'm just going to give it a good little mix. Set the phone down and then I'll be right back. Alright, so I mixed it up and you can see it's like a ball of just oats right now. So I'm taking it over to the sink. Add a little bit of water to mix it all up a little better. And then set the phone down to mix it. So I went ahead and put the oatmeal in the blender while I had my hands free. Um, gonna give it a few little spins, see how it spins. I like to use this one. I got my little cup of water here so I can add water as I go. Now it's spinning nicely. Look at it go. Give it a little test. Oh, uh, that's looking all right. Maybe a little bit more water. Get my 
jar I was talking about earlier. Open it up. Just pour it in. Alright, and she will eat probably all of that. These are eight ounce jars. Um and what I'll do is I'll just stick the rest in another jar and put it in the refrigerator or how much however much I have left, I'll put it in the freezer. Alright, so now we're just gonna give it a little test. See how baby likes it. Hi princess. Hi, honey. Oh, this is a purse that I made. It's first time making this. It was really fun project that I did. But I'll I'll make another one. This one's you know full of my mistakes and stuff. So I'll make another one and show you you know what I do with that. All right. Put the little bib on. Hey baby, you're so cute. Oh, you're gonna put it on yourself? You gonna do it? Okay, I'll do it. <laughs> nope, gotta move that, you know. Baby's got the longest arms. Ah, say ah. Oh, what do you think? Is it yummy? Is it good? Some more? Oh, yeah. I think she likes it. And that's how I make baby oatmeal. <laughs> You're a pretty girl. Alright, so that's how I do Alethea's breakfast in the morning. If you like this video, found it helpful at all, go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe for more videos. And leave me a comment. Tell me what you thought. Uh, tell me what you do for breakfast. And I'd love to see how far this video goes. So tell me where you're from. And I hope you all have a great day. Bye, guys.